The future of Newport Chemical Depot site is one step closer to being decided tonight. Good evening, I'm Mark Allen. And I'm Patrice Dayton. After the Newport Chemical Depot shut down earlier this year, plans on how to reuse the land has been up in the air. Uh, but after tonight's meeting, a final decision is near. News Dance Kate Green joins us live with the latest. Kate? Mark Patrice, tonight was the third and final public meeting on the depot. After months of feedback from the public and working with consultants, the Newport Reuse Authority presented its preferred master plan on how the site should be used. Now here's a look at the plan. The 7,000 acres of land is divided up in several parts. You'll notice here in the yellow that nearly 50% of that land will go to industrial development for Vermilion County and what they're calling three mega sites for bigger corporations. The other half of the property will be used for the natural preservation of forests with hiking trails and campsites and agricultural use that surrounds much of the property now. The Reuse Authority says this depicts much of what the public has asked for and they're excited to move on with this plan. Finally, we're coming to the end. We've been working on this for 10 years and uh, at, at some point we didn't even know where the tunnel was. Now we can see the light at the end of that tunnel. Now the Reuse Authority says the plan is subject to change slightly, but they hope to make a final decision next month to take to the U.S. Department of Defense. That's where they'll discuss more on how to require the land from the Army. And the Reuse Authority says they've had some interest from businesses and companies that would bring long-term jobs to the Wabash Valley. Mark, back to you. Thank you, Kate. Before that final decision is made, you still have a chance to voice your concerns or opinions about the plan. To find out how, you can log on to our website. WTHITV.com.